Hey. Greetings, traveler. Do you wish to obtain children's cardboard? Yeah, sure. That sounds fine. Whoa! Hey, that's pretty cool. Greetings gamers, and welcome to Nelly TV Pokemon. We're going to be opening Pokemon and other products at my whim. Today we got that Detective Pikachu little carrying case. Comes with seven packs. Seven Detective Pikachu booster packs. And a sticker sheet for you kiddos. Alright, let's get into it. You can put your little lunch in this, or... Here we have the little box. Little coin, pin, packs, and we'll see what else. And it's all gone to shit. Alright. Here we have the coin, if I can get it to focus. Epic win. Then we have all these packs. Looks like uh, seven Detective Pikachu, a Crimson Invasion, and a Guardian's Rising. And some toddler stickers, I suppose. You can put that on your G Fuel cup. And here's the little pin, it's actually quite cool. Let's see if my ape fingers can get this to work. There we go. Shiny. And a notepad. Anyway, this shit doesn't matter. We'll just throw this in the back. Get to the packs. Time for some horrendously terrifying, too close to real life. Art from the movies. And I believe every card is a hollow in this. I don't know if there's three to the front or not. Snubble and Ludicolo. Can we get a Mirror B cameo in the next Pokemon movie? That would be an epic win. Not really looking for anything in particular here, just trying to complete the set, I guess. And the next one. We have a little code card for you boys and girls back home. And then, more LOL. Snubble, I swear this is going to be the same pack as last time. Psyduck, looking like he's about to have a brain hemorrhage. And Mr. Mime hitting that whoa. Next pack. Hopefully we can get a little something creepier. Here is the code card for all you boys and girls back home. All right, we have Bulbasaur. Lickitung who's about to slob on a knob. Jigglypuff, AKA the next item to be featured in the Hydraulic Press channel. Does anybody still watch that? And oh baby, the one we were looking for, Mewtwo as the rare, number 12 of 18. Neat. Alrighty, getting into the next one. Little code card for you boys and girls back home. Then we have another potential prostitute. Another hydraulic press channel meme. Your mom on the bed. And slacking. Christ, he looks terrifying. He looks like my dad on a weekend after a couple of beers. All right, on to the next one. Still looking for that Charizard, but it looks like we got the Charmander right here. A little code card for you boys and girls back home. Charmander. This fucker again. Another Bulbasaur, don't mind him. And Machamp, directing traffic. The world would be terrifying if he existed in real life. Okay. 
two more Detective Pikachu packs to go. We'll see if we can get less duplicates. We have on the front a code card for you boys and girls back home. Lick a tongue attempting to be Instagram famous. Jigglypuff hitting the dub. Magikarp again. And Mirror Bee's assistant again. For fuck's sake. Final Detective Pikachu pack. Another. Dabbing Jigglypuff. Another Psyduck suffering from stroke. And yeah, I swear I'm getting trolled at this point. I can't honestly get the same card over and over, but we'll see. Magikarp. Doing Magikarp things. And Arcanine, that's actually pretty sweet. With security guard. A nice little hourly wage position. And a code card. Epic win. Time for the uh, regular packs. Actually, we're going to wait for that. We're going to get into this always dented, regardless of if you buy it directly from the store or online. You are not getting one of these without a dent. Pokemon packs. Pokeball. Put it on your shelf. This is going to be extremely hard to open without nails. Big ball. Any how-to basic watchers in this lobby? For fuck's sake, do they expect kids to be able to open this? Here we have a dented Pokeball. If Pikachu ever actually ended up in there, he wouldn't make it. This is supposed to have, I believe, three packs and a coin, if I remember right. Christ, they've just mashed them. Uh, Silvali, I believe. It's so shiny you can't even hardly see it. Silvali, I believe. Could be wrong. Could be terribly wrong. All right, we'll go uh, oldest to newest, I guess. No three to the front on, or uh, no energy on the back of these. Christ, what is happening here? All right. Code card. Here you go. One, two, three to the front. It's Dewat attempting to commit seppuku. Steelix Spirit Link. Shield on. Oh, it's lit. Litwick. Mareep. Krogunk, contemplating whether or not he can afford his rent or not. Tangle, <laughs> attempting to hang himself. <laughs> Rufflet. Oh, a break. I forgot we could even get these in here. A Pyroar break. Very nice. And for the final, a Clawitzer. Don't you just want to put him in a pot with some curry seasoning and eat him? Okay, getting a little bit more recent. We have a regular Sun and Moon pack. Can pretty much just hope for a secret. I fucked it with the code color, but I think that means we're getting something good. Three to the front. This energy is like fucked too. You can see that little Fucky. Okay. Here we have Bulldor. A timer ball. A surfer. A fat little rat. A big old cummy mess. A cloud. Another rock. 
a big old hairy mama. So Calio GX with Soul Burst. That's pretty epic. Let's try for another. Uh, this is going to be a Guardians Rising. I've ripped it open. Okay, I'm gonna pull the code card out so I don't mess it up. There's the code card for you boys and girls back home. One, two, three to the front. You fuck off this energy, water energy. Here we have some trees. A big old rocky boy. Stop. <laughs> My job. Does that remind anybody of the, uh, remember that kid that was like way too strong because his dad was abusing him and making him work out too much? Maybe just me. A coney boy. A crow stealing your grandmother's pearls. A sand shrew. The same <laughs> overly buff child attempting to hit the hardest yeah. in history. A chandelier as the reverse with shady move. And on the back, oh, a hollow, blissy with fresh egg. And double edge for you edge lords. Crimson Invasion, we just did a Guardians Rising recently. Open the pack, we see a magic harp at the front. Flip over the code card for you boys and girls back home. One, two, three to the front. Because it's Sun and Moon era, take off this and just fucking donate it to charity. All right. We have Haunter being that creepy guy at every party. A sea of nothingness. I don't, it's really nothing. Excel Gore. Another Magikarp jumping away from a robotic version of himself. Stuffle flocking in some flowers with flop. Some eggs. Nice. Jigglypuff witnessing a black hole eating the entire world. Chimiko being a bell because we've run out of ideas. A lowland marowak with dense of flames. And on the back, Starmie. Nice. All right, we're getting into the uh, last packs here. But don't worry, I've got some goodies for you good little boys and girls who've been watching. Open up the pack. On the front we have Geodude. We pull out the code card. For you boys and girls back home, enjoy. Then we go one, two, three to the front. Sacrifice this electric energy to Waylord. And flip it around. We have something you wouldn't want to step on while out in the water. Ooh. 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 That goth GF. Double fist man. A rat. Oh, it's lit. A panda. A piece of ice. A wimp. Reverse. And on the back. A hollow Gudra with power whip. Unfortunately, no nene. Also. A big boy. Shining Legends. Too big for the camera. There's Mewtwo. Give me. Looks like a promo, three packs, and a pin. Here's the little pin for you. He's using his psychic abilities, so I can't see him. Anyways, 
We have Shining Legends, of course. Here's most of the code card. We have Mewtwo flying. You're going to see, be seeing a lot more of this card because I'm going to be doing a Shining Legends every pack, every episode, in attempt to get that uh, rainbow Mewtwo. Sort of a Max Mofo rainbow Charizard meme. We have Snake. We have a cat. We have a mushroom. We have Pikachu's bad cousin. A bug that's on fire. For the reverse, we have a otter. And then we have a hollow Latios with Lagoon Flight. Here we have another Shining Legend. Get it, get it, open. Pikachu on the front. Here's your uh, little code card for you boys and girls. Pikachu in front of a rainbow. I will not make that mistake again. Three to the front. Fuck off the energy. Here we have a thug. Pikachu with a rainbow. That's actually quite nice. <laughs> a racial stereotype. Another mushroom. Or spore, rather. Pikachu's cousin again. <laughs> a big <laughs> mad fish. Your mom's vacuum. And... Oh, babies, Roarark GX. That's actually quite nice as well. With trade. And we're going to get into the final one here, featuring a little shiny Mew. He's another card I would love to see out of this pack. Here's your code card for your boys and girls back home. One, two, three to the front. Take the energy, donate it to charity. We have a ball. We have your friend. <laughs> we have flaming penis. Oh, we have two rats twerking. We have a fish about to die in the sun. We have a singular rat twerking. Another otter. Another thug. Carnivine Hollow giving you a little sexy look. And on the back we have, wow, I can't believe that. Three packs in already and we have, not well, not the rainbow, but it, it, ain't no, uh, it ain't no Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but it'll do. I mean, this is very surprising out of three packs to get two GXs and this one being the full art. Nice. Well, guys, thank you for watching. That's going to do it for episode one of Nelly TV Pokemon.